Seoul and Washington are both analyzing what the projectiles the North fired on Saturday could be. Experts say the photos Pyongyang released show that the North is developing its own version of Russia's ballistic missile system. Our Oh Jung Hee has the story. Seoul says the North's firing of short range projectiles on Saturday was not provocative. Washington agrees, saying it wasn't much of a threat, as the projectiles aren't mid long range or intercontinental ballistic missiles. It seems both are trying to keep tensions low and the momentum for dialogue with the North alive. But experts point out the projectiles were ballistic missiles. On Sunday, Pyongyang state media unveiled photos of its combat drill. Military experts say the picture showed 240 millimeter and 300 millimeter multiple rocket launchers and the North Korean version of Russia's Iskander mobile short range ballistic missile system. The North almost copied Russia's Iskander. The missile is able to move away from its original orbit to change its target or avoid being shot down. And that's why it's the newest ballistic missile. They say the solid fuel missiles can fly as far as 300 kilometers, putting a large part of the Korean Peninsula within range. Pundits add they're also capable of neutralizing THAAD, the advanced U.S. anti missile system. Watchers say the North wanted to press Seoul and Washington, but didn't want to prompt extreme tension. They say it could have also been a move against Seoul's ongoing joint military drills with Washington. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.